seven wealthiest and most influential meditation gurus, how they got their wealth, and what it consists of. Welcome to another exciting journey of knowledge in which we take you on the roller coaster of some interesting facts about the top wealthiest and influential meditation gurus and how they achieved their status. Before knowing about these gurus, let's talk about meditation. So, what is meditation? And why have people been attracted to it so much? Meditation is method that is used to reduce or eliminate the stress we face in our everyday life. Every one of us suffers some stress in our lives. Whether it is from our job or studies, we are constantly wired up with the stress, and it is exhausting. Meditation is a way to let go of all the stress, or at least some. With the increasing amount of stress in a person's life, the phenomenon of meditation has also become incredibly common among people. More and more people are attracted to it because of its health benefits. If you do not have an idea about meditation and how you can include it in your routine, relax. You're not alone. There are several people out there who do not know how to kill their stress by meditation. It is where social media power comes in. The internet has turned this world into a global village. It has made it so easy to access anything in the world. You're one click away from learning meditation. You can look out on Google about the meditation process and how you can do this at home. You can also search for gurus who have been teaching yoga and meditation for years. Nowadays, people are using social media platforms to teach yoga and meditation. Through this social media, people have been teaching meditation to millions of other people. And among these people, some have made millions and billions out of it. Some people have used meditation as their power to earn a lot of money, and today they are on the list of top wealthiest meditation gurus. Before knowing these gurus, Please like and share this video to let more people know about meditation and their gurus. Let us start the video. Number 7. Baba Ramdev, Yoga Guru. Motorcycle kaisa laga bolo? He is also known as Swami Ramdev, is a businessman and yoga teacher. He has been conducting and organizing yoga camps on a large scale since 2002. His yoga classes have also been broadcast on different TV channels. Coming from a very poor family, Baba Ramdev has made his name after 15 years of constant struggle. His father was a farmer in the city of Haryana. Baba Ramdev used to teach yoga in Haridwar. With his incredible and extraordinary knowledge of yoga son, he got fame. And now he holds a great place in politics. With his fame, his net worth he is one of the people of India who raised the issue of black money back in 2008. He is the owner of Divya Yogi Mandir and Patanjali Yogpith and all of its branches. Mata Amrin Thanandan Mai. Oru valiya 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 Thanandjiyanulla kadanna prayathnathina oru varsham thagin. Mata Amrin Thanandan Mai, or commonly known as Ama, is a guru, humanitarian, and Indian and Indian-based spiritual leader. She was born on September 27, 1953. She is immensely loved by her followers who call her the Hugging Saint. She is famous for providing comfort to broken people who are in great sorrow and grief. The reason she is called the Hugging Saint is that until now, she is close to more than 30 million people. She belongs to a poor background and during her childhood, she once had to go door to door to gather food. There she realized the intense suffering and poverty that existed in her country. It made her help the people around her. She also began to comfort people, and because of the affectionate love and care, people started calling her Ama. Her net worth is around... Her assets include many colleges, schools, and TV channels that are solely owned by her. These are also the sources of her income. Number 5. Sri Sri Ravishankar, Indian Guru. Success is not an ultimate something one day you achieve. Shortcut to success will cut short your success too. Among the most renowned and popular gurus in India, Sri Sri Ravi Shankar is considered responsible for giving the world the art of foundation. He was born on May 13, 1956 in Tamil Nadu. He took Vedic studies at the age of six. When he turned 17, he completed his degree in Vedic literature and started his services in the mid-1970s. He is immensely popular and has followers from all around the world. According to research, a report was made which says that Sri Sri Ravi Shankar 
has more than 300 million followers in around 151 countries from all over the world. His assets are worth Art of Living, also known as AOL, is his main source of income. These include Art of Living Pharmacy, Art of Living Institutes, and AOL Health Centers. Number 4. Baba Shivananji Maharaj I accept myself. Advut Shiranand was born on March 26, 1955, in Delhi. But then he was moved and raised in Rajasthan. When he turned eight years old, he met Swami Jagannath, a Himalayan yogi who inspired him to become a spiritual guru. After that, he visited many sacred places for meditation. He is popular among people for the ancient stories that he shares, and he is praised and loved by millions of people around the world. He is the role model for many people in India as well as in other countries. His current wealth consists of more than 6 million US dollars, around f and is on the list of most rich spiritual gurus in India. He is the founder of Shiv Yog Foundation, which is the main source of his income. He also hosts seminars and public shows that are played and can be seen on various TV channels including Sanskar TV, Adhyatam, and Asta. Number 3. Satguru Yagi Vasudev when you hit sixty, in many ways, your fundamental structure within the system is changing. Sadhguru Yagi Vasudev was born on 3rd September 1957, is an author and Indian yogi. He is one of the prominent and rich gurus in India. He got his beholder's degree from the University of Mysore in English and decided to become a yoga teacher. He started his yoga teachings in 1982. He was interested in meditation and yoga from his childhood. It is the reason why he decided to pursue meditation at the age of only 25. He used to travel on his motorcycle and held yoga classes in Karnataka and Hyderabad. He is the founder of the Aisha Foundation that is engaged in providing education to all people all around the world. His net worth is around 2.5 million US dollars. He also owns an asset of net worth around a he was awarded a big Nobel award known as the Padma Vibhushan Award for his exceptional contribution towards meditation and spirituality. Number 2. Paul Dinakaran Baba You are addicted to evil habits. You have cheated many people. Repent tonight. Paul Dinakaran Baba was born on 4th September 1962 in Chennai, India. He got his BSc degree from a college in Chennai. Although he does not look like a guru from his physical appearance, he is one of the most popular and rich gurus of India. He is busy spreading the greatness of Jesus, and his work includes telling people about the miracles of Jesus. The estimation of his net worth is about that is 770 million US dollars. He is also a founder of Karunya University. It is located in Kolmbator, and currently 7,500 students are studying there. With this huge net worth, he is one of the wealthiest gurus in India. Number 1. Gurmit Ram Rahim Singh Insan He was born on the 4th of August 1972 at in Uttakarand. He was raised in Nepal, where he spent his childhood. When he returned to India, he got admitted to Kanpur Gurukal for educational purposes and met Ramdev. He is considered to be the wealthiest spiritual leader of India. The sources of his income include Yog Sandesh magazine. He holds the position of chief editor of the magazine. Moreover, he owns more than 34 companies. The company Patanjali Ayurved is a fast-growing company and it has changed the fortune for both Balkrishna and Baba Ramdev who co-founded this company. Along with it, he also owns pharmaceutical companies that are located in Uttarakhand and generate an annual net worth of $14 million. According to some reports, he amassed a total net worth of close to a billion US dollars. All these gurus have made yoga and meditation their power to earn money, and today they have become the richest people in India with their yoga and meditation skills. We hope you enjoyed the video and all the interesting facts that we told you. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. Also, share this video with your friends and family. What do you think about meditation and yoga? Have you ever tried them? And who is your favorite yoga guru? Share with us in the comments below. Thank you for watching, subscribing, and liking our content. Stay blessed, my brothers and sisters.